Lone Stranger. And take a little look at some Dutch bling here today. I have to get a lot closer for you to see this. Taking a look at the tarp flies today. It's another way of rigging up your tarp with a permanently attached suspension. It's not a continuous ridge line. Attach it to either end. I happen to get a new one for a new tarp that's coming in so I can show you what you start with. So if I hank a line about, I get 25 feet of reflect it. It's, uh, you're looking for like about a 1.8 millimeter, 1.75 millimeter line to use with the tarp flies. I'll get the 25 feet. I'll cut that in half. All right, we're gonna take a really close look to be able to see this here. I started running this line through earlier because you gotta push it through with a, an awl or a needle. It's a rather tight hole. But it's just a loop that goes through the two holes and then over the top. This line will run to the tree, back, and through here and then around the top to hold it in place. We're going to take a look at that in actual use here in a minute. But I want to show you really up close so you get an idea of how tiny this thing is. <laughs> it's two grams. And, uh, and it's really pretty simple to put together yourself. Uh, you can get them to put together the lines for you, but it's easy enough to do it yourself. Now we're going to go over and we're going to take a look at an actual tarp. First I'm going to show you from a distance. So you can see how easy this is to string up. I've already done the other side and this isn't really how I would hang my tarp. <laughs> but I want to do a demonstration. All I've done is take it around the tree, through the hook, pulled it tight, back over the nubs on the top. And I'll go through twice just to make sure it's there, but you really don't need to do that. But you can do that twice on either end and you've got your tarp up. It makes it very easy to tension it, makes it very easy to change whether you're closer to one tree or another. It's just a very flexible setup. Now I'm going to come back and I'm going to show you this again up close. Okay, now we can take a really close look at this. Um, and it's super simple. It's just a matter of going around the tree, running it through that hook. You want to pull to get however much tension you want because it's going to hold it. And then through that front nub, around the back antenna, or I don't know which one's an antenna, but you say I do it twice. They, you don't really need to do it twice. It's just force of habit for me to make sure that it's there. You can see I've done just a knot to tie it on there. You could do a loop and make it easy to remove. I'm permanent. Um, but yeah, it's super simple, a couple of grams, and it makes setting up so much easier. Check out the rest of the review video on trail space if you want more details, but I think I've covered pretty much everything you need to know right here. And there you've got it. Dutchware, bling, tarp flies. Hope that helps.